All right, here we are. We are on the way home with Difference Maker. Hope you guys enjoy this ride with me. Oops, let me fix it for you there. Oh, I'm gonna make this light here. Woo! Just driving along. So, how's your day been going? I hope it is going well, being blessed in the Lord. Uh, I'm really seeing that the church, the church or the so-called church is in need of sound doctrine, sound teaching. We need to be taught the word of God. We need to humble ourselves and listen to teachers who know what they're talking about. I think sometimes people think that they can just go in their Bibles and learn all that they can and are not humble enough to be taught. If you look in Acts 8, the eunuch says that says to Philip, who can show me these things? Who can teach me these things? And that's the amazing thing. Who can teach? There are people that God has gifted to teach His Word. And we just have to be humble to that. Oops, I'm driving over there on the side. People are passing me because I'm trying to hold this camera and drive. Well, maybe I'll put the camera back here so we can see. But yes, definitely. You know, we have to humble ourselves and listen to sound doctrine. That's why Timothy and Titus were ex ex exhorted to teach sound doctrine. Well, if they were exhorted to teach it, somebody had to hear it. We need Bible teachers. We need pastors to faithfully preach and teach the Word of God that are apt to teach. We need to get back to that, to teaching. To teaching, bringing things in teaching format. That's getting lost today. Everybody is grabbing a Bible and saying what they think about it, what it is and what's that because of what the false churches have done. Well, you can't blame the false churches. You got to be a part of the solution. You got to obey the Word of God. Get some learning. Learn the Bible. You sit under someone and learn the Word of God. Experience and apply the Word of God to your life. Then go out and teach it teach it to other people you know that needs to come back to the local church and then that is definitely missing today another news got about two more months until my daughter or son is born don't know we're not finding out until the uh, birth of the baby um, this will be of my fifth child praise the Lord for that praise the Lord it'll be the, the fifth child in, in the Miller family um, I, my oldest will be seven in August and it just seems like these years are going by so fast and that means that the Lord Jesus Christ is is returning he's coming back so hopefully we will see him soon Lord Jesus just come Oh yeah, the music you hear is Show Baraka, and I think it's, this is the album Turn Up My Life, I believe, so I hope you're enjoying that. So what's going on in your world? Feel free to hit me up on Facebook and uh, tell me what's happening with you as you take a ride home with Difference Maker. I remember I used to do these where I would do a ride with Difference Maker. Well, I'm going to call this a ride home with Difference Maker. Also, I advise you to check out uh, Lane Channel's uh, video vlog where he's talking with Phil Johnson about celebrities in the church. I think that will be a good, interesting um, video for you guys to check out. Um, there are a lot of people that want to be celebrities. You cannot be a celebrity in Christianity. You're a slave. 
You're slave to Christ. That's what you are. So, check that out when you guys get a chance. All right, well, I'm coming home now. God bless. Take care. See you next time on a car ride.